Hello, ladies and gentlemen of the internet. I am the Marmoset, and this is a five-minute burst of FTL. As promised again, because I'm a man, you should know by now, who keeps his promises, we're going to trade out four missiles for 32 scrap. That's a nice amount of scrap. We're going to really enjoy that amount of scrap. 80 scrap, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. Right. On to the exit. Hopefully, we're going to come up with some merchants soon enough. Right. We get... Yep, I know we can jump. Ooh, drone parts. I don't have a drone thing. I'm not likely to get a drone thing anytime soon. Do I want the scrap? Yes, I will sell six drone parts. So this episode has started off with plenty of trading. Let's go to the ship thing, because I want to upgrade my guns. Except that means that means I can unpower it. And I have two lasers and a halberd beam. Let's also grab... The shield upgrade, so now we only need 40 scrap and we can have two points in shields. Or I can drop that and add more shields. So we now have options. Options I'm probably going to get wrong and you're probably going to whinge at me in the comments. In the interim, let's send Matthew to the med bay while we jump to the next sector. Rebel controlled or a civilian sector. I am a coward. I'm going to go to the civilian sector. I want some peace and quiet for a bit. I want more interactions and less fighting. So, while he heals up, shop. Well, we just spent everything, so I'm not going to go there because I'll just, I'll just feel grumpy. A load of nebula points. Interesting. Another curious path. I think we'll be pipping through these nebula points and then coming around on the back. So we should have plenty of time because the uh, rebel fleet will be badly delayed by the nebula. A small merchant vessel. Me small merchant ship message you. Underground Federation Comchals are talking all about your secret mission. Let us install a weapon to help. Good luck. Okay, so the ion bomb thing we popped up a few episodes ago has reappeared. Um, we've got a fair few missiles. Um, and the charge time on this is abominable. It's actually longer than the halberd beam. So I'm going to leave it for now. This is really useful when you start getting more towards the end game because being able to disable for four points of iron damage on a on a target is going to be really handy. Uh, distress beacon? Yeah, let's do nice guy moves. Okay. Yep, yeah, yeah, we suck. <laughs> we suck. We just took a shed load of damage for no good reason. You go back over there, and now we have a hull breach. Okay. You two here. One out of there, power that back up. So we've got to get this fixed. You two work on there. You get in there and start fixing this before the oxygen runs out. No idea if that helps or not. To me it makes sense. Yeah, you've got a hull breach there, but you're sharing the load out. Hmm, I don't know if the game has that level of resolution. Healing, 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 healing and back to your stations. Jump. Diving into the nebula to give ourselves an extra little bit of time. Hmm, great deal of power reduction. Manly search the wreckage. Took another thumping. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's kind of, this is uh, turning into a, do you want to batter your ship in a nebula day? Yes. Why? Because we can't see where we're going, so we're just smashing into things that are out and about outside. Another ion storm. So we've got power problems. Do have a pair of weapons up. And that's a big missile launcher. I'd have preferred it if the other one was available, because then our shields might be able to take it. Um, everyone's in position. Don't have enough power for the halberd beam. I don't want to pull anything out of the oxygen just yet. Given that apparently we've got a hull breach in our cockpit, um, let's just concentrate on trying to get some of his guns offline. Hmm. A hit. So I'll have to wait and see if we get lucky on that. This is going to really sting when this missile fires. Another hit. They've got a lot of points. This is going to be a big missile. Four points of damage. There we go. Was I not right? Not wrong in that. Okay. Um. Yep. Yeah, I'm just going to keep firing as we are. There's a hull breach. I can hear it. Come on, come on, fire again. Oh, 
mid-fight were stopped this time, ladies and gentlemen, by the dinging of my phone. Thank you very much for watching this five-minute Birds of FDL. This fight is not looking too good. We're down to less than half health, and we've taken a lot of damage through my bad flying, more than anything else. So I'll see you next time. Please remember to like and subscribe.